Hey guys, what's up? This is Ziploc Rules 2013, and welcome back to Let's Play Wii Sports Resort. Today, we're going to be playing some canoeing. This is probably one of the more overlooked mini games. Probably one of the less popular ones. Probably the least popular uh, sport in this game. Um, not to say that it's got a bad reputation, I wouldn't say. I don't know. Um, definitely not one you hear people talking about, though. And, um, I like it. It's actually the first one I ever showed off on this channel. The very first video on this channel is, uh, me playing a round of this. And, uh, why does it want me to calibrate it again? I don't know, but we will calibrate it again. What? What do you mean communications failed? Why is this remote being... Um... I think I need to use my other remote. Hang on a moment. I dragged this other Wiimote out to see if it would work, and it was working. Apparently that changed. I don't know why. <sighs> Hang on, I apologize. Uh, let's go ahead and connect this again. Hello? Are we going to work? Okay, now we're going to work. All right. Sorry about that. My remote disconnected. I don't know what that was. Uh, but yes, this is canoeing. There are five stamps you can collect. There is beginner license. Uh, basically, um, your goal is to ultimately be able to complete um, a specified distance within a specific period of time. So, uh, in each of the difficulties. So, in beginner, that's 200 yards. And then you'll get your license. Uh, for intermediate, it's 300 yards. And then for expert, it is 400. Uh, ducks in a row is a practice mode stamp. It's very easy to get. Um, excuse me, probably one of the more laid-back stamps you get. Cut the red tape. This ties into the licenses. Basically, once you get your license, sky's the limit, and you are allowed to go as far as you can within the time limit. Generally, it's about between a minute to a minute and a half. It's a minute here on uh, Beginner, and, um, or does it go to two minutes? I don't remember, actually. But, uh, yeah, <laughs> you get the point. So, basically, uh, the red tape's going to be 100 yards after each license. So, an expert, you'll have to go 500 yards for that. Uh, so, that'll be something else. But, um, I don't, don't count on me getting the red tape stamp here. I'm not very good at cutting the red tape on single player. In fact, on my main me, I actually kind of cheated. I did the four-player cheat where you just have four Wii remotes in your hands. You know, two in each. And basically just use that because you can get more distance there easier. And I basically used that to get the stamp. So I wholeheartedly admit I did cheat to get it. Why is my uh, my paddle is not acting right? What the shit? Uh... My remote is sitting on the table fl Uh, what is wrong with my remote? Why? What is wrong with this thing? And... Oh, shit. Um, we're having some technical difficulties. Sorry, the Wii's, uh, very well-crafted, uh, very quality controller is, uh, acting a little strange. That's very... That's a very new thing for a Wii player. Whoa, a controller fail when playing with a Wii remote. How, uh, how unheard of. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. Uh, the controls for this minigame, very simple. Just, uh, basically mimic the motions you would make if you were paddling a canoe. I've actually never ridden in a canoe, but, uh, my uncle used to take me for rides in his kayak. Uh, and we would just kind of paddle around Lake Ontario, which used to be fun. So I guess you could say I'm sort of experience with this? Not really. Um, but, uh, I don't know. I, I imagine I would enjoy this in real life. Now, here we're going to be getting all of the uh, ducklings here for the Ducks in a Row stamp. There are ten of these little ducklings. And, uh, basically, they run straight from their mother, which is not good. And we have to locate all ten of them. And, um, it's a little weird. They sometimes don't see you when you go past them and you have to go back for them, which is very annoying. Uh, can get kind of annoying, but uh, here I'm getting pretty lucky with uh, them being able to see me. And yeah, they're basically, they're always in the same spot, so uh, you always, basically you can um, 
it'll tell you how long it takes for you to get this. Okay, up there I can tell I got it. You can see the flashing number. Um, it doesn't matter how long it takes you to get them uh, for the stamp. Although, later on, uh, once you get the stamp, you can go for a high score and it will reward you. you know, it'll, it'll acknowledge when you get a high score, which is pretty cool. Uh, whenever you beat your record time. There's the mother duck right there, the large white one. And, uh, yeah, yeah, it's just a, such a nice minigame. Very peaceful, just fun. You know, it's not exciting or anything, but it's fun. Just nice, calm, relaxing fun. You know, it's like, it's like fishing in Twilight Princess. Or, I don't even know. I was going to say 1080 snowboarding, but eh, that game's kind of energetic, I guess. <laughs> that wouldn't be a very good comparison, would it? I, I maybe Wave Race 64, Blue Storm. Those are a bit more tame, a little more chill, I suppose. And wait, actually, no, the last one's over here. Here's a little strategy you can use to uh, kind of reposition the way your canoe is going. No way, I just literally got him. What What am I thinking? What am I... Th Ziploc, what are you doing? Oh, God. I'm going crazy, apparently. Did I get the guy that was over here? Over here by these lily pads and weeds? I want to say no. But it looks like yes. Okay, who the heck am I missing, then? Um, oh, ooh, ooh. Did I go to that? No, I did not. I did not go to that large... Uh, patch of grass over there. There's a duckling over there. So, yeah, get all ten of them and bring them back to their mother. Sorry, this will probably end up being a slightly longer video. I would like to get the licenses in each of the different difficulties. I don't think I should have any trouble doing that. Uh, at least back in the day, I didn't. Uh, but don't count on me getting the red tape. I've gotten the red tape by myself in all of them, but when I did go for the stamp, I did cheat. I did later on do it on my own, but just know that, I don't know, it took a while. So don't expect me to randomly just pull out of my, pull it off here, I don't know. Uh, but I got it in 4 minutes, 16 seconds, which is pretty cool. As long as you do it at all, then you will get the stamp. Now, time to run, it'll start off at 100 yards which is half of what you're going to eventually have to do. I just whack the table with my remote. That's great. Uh, make deep motions if you can, but also kind of moderate your speed. Make sure you kind of make sure you're actually getting some water in there with your paddles. You know, you don't want weak little dinky little taps in the water. You actually want to get some or you actually want to get some distance. And that is pretty decent. Could be better. I actually have my armrests on my chair here folded backwards, which is a really nice feature on this chair. I don't know who came up with that feature, but they are a genius for it. And yes, ducks in a row, that's pretty cool. And depending on how well you do in each round, it'll give you a uh, objective for the next round. Let's see, see how far you can get. 180, so that is almost beginner license material right there. Uh, not quite, though. I'll have to do probably just one extra little round there. Uh, I will ask you to practice every, I, I think, for like the first few rounds. I think just until you unlock intermediate. Oh, that was bad. I didn't have any. You can't row before you go, so I kind of wasted some time there. Whatever. Uh, getting the licenses is generally not hard. The expert one might be a little tricky for me. Seeing as I'm definitely not as good at this game as I used to be. So I don't know. Maybe that one will be problematic. Hopefully not. Hopefully it should be um, manageable. But I don't know. It has been years. <laughs> it has been absolute years. I don't even know if when I started streaming I even played this when I streamed this game a very few times. But um, I used to be pretty decent at this. Yeah, uh, not a master or anything. Like, I wasn't going on Wii Records and posting my stuff. At least not in this minigame. Uh, I did do that a few times, though. 200 yards. All right, so this will be our beginner license 
um, lake tests, I guess. Kind of your road test equivalent, maybe, if you will. Uh, but yeah, once we get this, the uh, distance markers will be going away. It'll just be an empty course, and it'll just be us trying to be our personal bests, which will be pretty damn awesome. And um, I hope I can at least cut the red tape here on beginner. Um, I forget if those ducks can actually like slow you down. You obviously don't want to hit the lily pads or the weeds. That's bad. Those will very quickly slow you down and significantly at that halfway point. That is pretty good. And, um, yeah, so, oh, don't hit the buoys here. I didn't really matter here. Here it doesn't really matter all that much, but, I don't know. Wanna, I, I want to look cool for YouTube, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. I want to look cool for the audience. But whatever, we got 200 yards there. And I will do one post-license match, probably on each of these difficulties, just see uh, how I do. We got the beginner license, which is awesome. Now you have your beginner license, the races will be a challenge to, yep, see how far you can go within the time limit. So let's see if we can do, so let's see if we can do 300. 300 would be cutting the red tape here on the beginner mode, so let's see if we can actually do that. And uh, I, haven't t I haven't tried this out in quite a while, so this will be one hell of a uh, experiment, I suppose. And, um, yeah, try and get a balance of deep strokes, but also going decently fast, I guess. But uh, you don't want to go so fast that you're barely even hitting the water with your paddle and then... Like you're barely getting any distance. That's a really bad way of going about this. And uh, definitely not one you want to do. But here I should still be able to at least get close to the tape. But again, it would be really awesome to cut it. And I do have a somewhat memorized strategy of how to uh, maneuver the courses when you're trying to maximize your distance. Let's see, we're getting close here. Oh man. Let's see, can I get 300? Come on. Let's go. Oh, barely. Let's go. 300. Alright, as long as you get to 300, you will break that tape. Oh man. Alright. I'm hopeless for getting the intermediate or expert ones, I'm sure, but hey, we got it. We got the beginner one, and that is awesome. It's a new record. Oh, 301. I think my record here is like 315, maybe? I don't know. I'd have to check my uh, original data, which I can't do now because... Why did that not... Oh, you've got to be kidding. Oh, no. It's still got the stupid play five times to unlock the... Oh, come on. I just got my beginner... I just cut the red tape and it's going to make me do it again. Ah, uh, that's annoying. That, that, see, that's dumb. Your license should be what unlocks the next difficulty. So that's pretty dumb. I don't know what whoever Nintendo, whoever at Nintendo thought that was a good idea. What I, I don't even know. What is the thought process there? Seriously. But what are you gonna do? You can't. Uh, yelling at the game won't make it any better. So I don't know. See if we can do it again. Probably not. I guess I shouldn't get down on myself, though. So, let's see if we can do it again. Oh, not if I hit those. Not if I hit those. Oh, that's not good. That is not good at all. Um, seriously, like, come on. I get the beginner license. Oh, well, maybe you're not good enough. Dude, <laughs> by your own admission, I'm good enough. <laughs> get the hell out of here. Ah, uh, oh boy, yeah, I'm not cutting. I ain't cutting jack squat here. Uh-uh. And you get the kind of sad music because, oh, I didn't get a new record. Uh, but whatever, I still gained some skill points, which is cool. I think I had Superstar class here at one point. If not, I don't think I had 2,500, but I want to say I had Superstar class here at one point. Um, but eventually it just gets, like, really hard to actually gain any points. Uh, I don't even know. 100 yards to go. Oh, come on. 
I can do more in that game. Want to try and hold me back here. Um, yeah, this is definitely going to be one of the longer videos here. I do apologize. Um, not much I can really do on that front, though. Uh, I don't think it would make much sense to split canoeing up into two videos. I think it would be a little, a little obnoxious, if you will. Oh, whatever. Just go ahead and get 100 yards. Come on, I can totally do more than that. And yes, that's pretty cool. So I think you get 90 seconds actually on the clock now, which is pretty cool, meaning you should get two minutes for uh, expert or 90 seconds. Okay, 195. So uh, the intermediate license, as said earlier, will be 300. So we're gonna need to do probably at least one more after this. Uh, hopefully not two to get uh, License, but again, it doesn't matter because I still need to do five rounds. There's stupid unlock rules. They couldn't have made like a simple little exception here. Not to make a huge deal out of it because it's not <laughs> all that big of a deal, but it's still dumb. I don't know. Don't really understand the thought process there. Stay away from the little fishies. Uh, they might look cute. Actually, they don't really. <laughs> they kind of look evil here, but um, they are not your friend, and they will slow you down. They'll even throw you off track in some cases. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> that's really not good. Uh, the Wii emblem up there on the little spectator's row. Yeah, the Wii logo is just so iconic now. Like, everyone recognizes it. Even... It might sound weird enough. There are people on the internet that weren't even born when the Wii came out. Uh, even they'll recognize it, even if they didn't have a Wii U. Uh, man, what an iconic logo. And just so f nice to see it randomly plastered in the game. Okay, 255. So, after this, as long as we do well enough, we should be able to just go for our license. And we'll just see about the red tape. Maybe we'll at least see it on screen. Have that as our overall goal. Just see all the red tape on all the difficulties on screen. Because here, like I said, I'm not too confident that I'll actually get it. Stupid little ducklings. Get the heck out of here. You're cute and all. And I know, yeah, you just love the yellowness of my <laughs> canoe over here. You see yourself in me, but I have shit to do. I have important shit to do. So, uh, yeah, piss off. <laughs> uh, I don't even know what the hell I'm talking about anymore. And these fish are, I don't even think these guys were here last time, probably because this is where the goal was. And, yep, uh, that really slowed me down. It definitely did something. I couldn't really tell if it slowed me down all that much. Oh yeah, I'm only coming in here with 18 seconds left. Yeah, I don't think I have much of a chance. Basically, it goes over there, and somewhere along the lines is the goal for the license. And then it turns a little corner, and then that's the tape. We should unlock our license here. Uh, our license trial. Oof. Uh, why? Never mind. Five, five yards short. Okay, that's... Uh, seriously? Whatever. Okay, I guess we're going to be here a little longer. <laughs> I, I do want to get all my licenses. Um, they're just easy enough stamps to get out of the way. Now, um, when it comes to getting the red tape stamp, um, that one I'm not sure if I'll even get on stream. I don't want to do the four-player cheat thing. Um, if you guys are okay with that or would consider that legitimate maybe but I don't know to me it just seems would seem a little odd just wouldn't feel as legitimate um I don't know like I know I can do it because I have done it um in single player mode before but I don't know it, it gets tough especially on expert uh, that's for sure it's so retarded that they can cap it off five yards short. Like, come on. 
If that isn't the most deliberate uh, trolling there, I don't know what it is. Ah, uh, whatever. Alright, so, a new record. It'll always acknowledge your new records, but... I don't know. It don't mean much anything when all you're going for is a stamp or when it's a set amount of time. Yeah, wow, that was a bad round right there. Five seconds left. Ah, uh, that's still enough to get the license, but... I don't know, that is cutting it pretty gosh darn close, if you will. Or if you ask me. Like, seriously, just give me the freaking license round. I mean, it should cap you off like, okay, it's either 280 or 300. 295, like, come on. I don't know. To me, that's just a bit over the top. Uh, I'm trying to kind of experiment with just deep strokes or just, you know, going really fast. Kind of a mixture of both, but it's hard to do a mixture of both. So, I don't know. We're just kind of throwing into the wind, just seeing what, or I don't know, throwing shit at the wall, seeing what sticks, I guess, is a better way of phrasing that. I don't know, it doesn't really sound very good, but it is pretty accurate. Just kind of seeing, okay, will this work? Oh, no, that didn't work. Maybe this will work. Maybe this will work. Who knows? Uh, but yeah. So, basically, Expert expert will introduce some new elements here. It's going to be mostly the same, though. Uh, there's going to be... I mean, you'll see it. There are some new elements. Really, it just feels like a slightly more difficult version of what we have here. Whereas, this feels a lot more substantial, I guess, than um, beginner mode. So, it's not going to be as much of a jump, I guess. I don't even think I'm gonna go for the red tape there. Just to, just for the video's length. Uh, I think we'll just assume I wouldn't get the tape if I were to try to do it. I know it's kinda lame to do that, but. Oh man, we're at like 20 minutes. All right, intermediate license, awesome. And expert mode has been unlocked. Uh, so yeah, I shouldn't have had to do that extra beginner mode. I'm blaming that on the video's length. Or I'm, I'm blaming the video's length on that, specifically. Because I don't care what you say, that is objectively a weird thing to do. Now, here is the expert run. So it looks a lot longer to go 100 yards here. Uh, it definitely feels a bit longer. Uh, you're going to have these little water spouts, and they'll kind of push you off to the side of a little current. And, um, yeah, you kind of have to uh, work with that. And, um, yeah, so the red tape here is going to be a 500-yard uh, stride, a 500-yard little run, row? I don't even know what you would call that for canoeing. Um, but, yeah, it's, oh, is it only 100 seconds? Oh, I think it's only 10 seconds more you get here. I didn't even look at the timer there, but whatever. Um, so it does get a bit more difficult here. But it's really not the same thing. I don't know. It's not the same thing as going from beginner to intermediate. Now there we got to jump to 225 yards. Which is pretty cool. And we'll try and get our license as quick as possible. If I do well enough on the license round, which something tells me I probably won't. But if we do, I guess I can go for the license. Intermediate. I don't know what it was with intermediate. I know I've gotten the license there before, but I think I just barely got to the 400-yard mark. Uh, whereas here, I think I've gotten to, like, 515. So I've gotten slightly past the tape. Um, you know, it, it, it just enough where it wasn't, like, <laughs> on the edge of my seat wondering if I was going to get it. Um, whereas that was how it was with Intermediate. I remember that vividly. Um, that one I was... I don't know what it was with Intermediate. I just... I found it... Not that I found it overall more difficult, but just the red tape section was definitely more, uh, difficult. Now right here... Try and swerve between these. Oh, that did not work. Oh, god damn it, that didn't work. Go! Go, go, go! 
Oh, you're wasting time. Oh, god dang it. No. Oh, no. That was bad. I barely touched that thing. I just slowed to a halt. Oh, that's horrible. That might have been... <laughs> I, I mean, I might have done well overall there for the most part, but oh, that ruined it. Oh, yeah, only 60 extra. That is abysmal. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know. That's all it takes to uh, ruin a uh, run. It's just one little fail, and that's it. It's pretty much just game over for you. Like, obviously, we still finished, but I mean, we're still in the 200s terms of our goal oh what are you gonna do that really sucks <laughs> that really freaking sucks not gonna lie uh, that would that that's instant reset usually like if I wasn't recording right now I'd probably reset the run just so that we would have uh, a higher win margin there but in just for time's sake I don't think that's really worth it here Oh no, quit going into the little thing, those giant chestnuts or walnuts or whatever the heck. Get them out of here. Um, yeah, they create a really big current. Uh, honestly, try this one more time. This is what you try, see, come on. Uh, I used to have such a good strategy built up for that. And it is just gone. I don't know why I tried that again. Oh, that's so annoying. It's all it takes to just screech you to a halt. Um, usually it's, get the hell, move, move. Oh, Lord. Oh, I'm so sorry. I should not be uh, doing that. That is playing with fire there. Yeah, you should not be finishing with that low of time. Holy shit, that is pathetic. Um, I don't know. I used to, I, I was so good at getting that back in the day, I don't know. I'm just not what I used to be, I guess. Oh, come on, only 310. I know that was bad, but that's a pretty pathetic increase. Um, whatever. I, I promise now I won't go for that, how's that? Good God, that is like, like you're going from full speed to just absolute zero. Pretty much there. And there's pretty much nothing you can do about it. You can reset and whatnot all you want, but in terms of uh, in that moment, there is not a gosh darn thing you can do to make it better. All you can do in that case is just pretty much end it and retry. Go, 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 go. All right, there. Yeah, usually you get here with like, if you were gonna break the red tape, You'd get here with like 80 seconds left, generally. Wait, turn, turn. Oh, why is the turning not doing it? Oh, man. Yeah, I really don't remember my routing here. Like, I remember where to go, but specifically how you do it is uh, my weak point so far. Yeah, I'm just gonna kinda go in here. I guess that's, I mean, it's faster than what I was doing before. Four, but good lord that is not that is not okay at all performance wise uh, I really should probably go around these buoys not actually go into them or, or well obviously don't go into them but like between them where the little geysers at probably not something worth doing okay can I do my Something tells me probably not. It's probably not going to let me do the license yet. Um, I don't know. I did. I was at least able to break the tape on beginner. I didn't think I'd be. Oh come on! It's 25. Oh no! It's going to torture us. <laughs> I'm getting my license here. Um, but man, is it being annoying about it? I don't really know what the deal is. I didn't remember having to do this many matches or rounds back in the day. Like, I know I'm not as good, but I'm way underperforming from what I thought I'd be doing by now. I thought I'd at least have a chance at going for the tape on uh, Intermediate and maybe even here. 
But uh, that is absolutely not in the cards. Mostly just for timing reasons. And I would hate... God, we're at like half an hour here. I'm going to... I'm going to probably do two more rounds here. If it doesn't let me go for my license, I think I'll have to end it off. Because uh, it's being ridiculously strict with uh, the time. I don't know why. Uh, a lot stricter than I remember it being. But, oh well. What are you going to do, I guess? Let's go through here. Uh, faster than... Uh, faster than hitting the buoy and just getting owned. Now here, oh god, yeah. The little geysers are really annoying. Not much you can do about it, though. But yeah, I'll do two more rounds here, and hopefully it'll actually let me go for the uh, license. Hopefully. I have some degree of hope, maybe. Oh man, 11 seconds? Yeah, no. You're supposed to have, like, 25, 30 seconds there. Uh, if you even have a chance of going for the tape. I don't remember what my strategy was any different, really. Like, it didn't really... F it's a new I, I feel like I'm doing mostly what I did before. So I'm not really sure what's different. I don't know. Alright, we're gonna do this. And if it doesn't let me go to 400... And get the license, I think I'll just end it off. That'll be an easy enough stamp to get on stream. Which I will do one next weekend. And yeah. Man. You do, uh, your arm gets a bit of an exercise. My arm's getting a little sore here. Um, I used to be, I don't know, I used to play this one a decent bit. I'd say 2013. I played this uh, quite a bit, actually. And that's when I got the uh, red tape stamp. I was actually good enough to do it uh, here. I don't know. After how we performed here, I don't even think I'm going to try for it on stream. Uh, sad as that is to say, because I remember really enjoying this mode, trying to go for high scores, but... I don't know, I'm just not there anymore. Not nearly good enough at it. But that is perfectly okay. Memories are memories. I never got it really... I, I might have... No, I did a little video series, I think, of this back in the day. Where I got all the stamps. So I don't remember if I did it single player. Like without the Wiimote cheat. Uh, but I know I... I had to have gotten some good distances. Um, so I don't know. Uh, no! God, no! Literally. That was the worst. Oh. Okay, I don't think it's gonna let us get the light. Come on! One set of weeds right there. Oh, that's so shitty. I lost skill points for that. I beat my high score. I did not know that was possible. You can beat your high score and lose skill points. Yeah, nah. Fuck that. Yeah, 370. Yeah, it's garbage. I do not remember it being that strict. Uh, or maybe it's not even that it's strict. I'm just rusty at it, I guess. Man, I, I don't feel like I'm playing any different. So, I don't know. Maybe we'll go for it. Uh, we'll go for the license on stream for sure, but I'm pretty... I don't think we're going to go for the red tape on stream. I just don't think it'd be worth it. Unless you don't mind me doing it with the four-player remote sheet. Then I guess I can half count it on my stamp count. Um, but whatever. So that was fun. That's canoeing. And definitely an underrated mode. Definitely one... I think more people should get into. And uh, it's definitely understandable. It's not... Canoeing isn't the first thing you think of when you think, Oh yeah, vacation. I want to just just go around a little pond next to a castle. The castle helps kind of set the mood, but... Still not a very eventful mode. But, yeah, whatever. Next time on Let's Play Wii Sports Resort, we're going to be hitting the biking trail in cycling and yeah that'll be a lot of fun that's actually one of my favorite modes but 
That being said, I'm going to go ahead and sign off. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope we look forward to the next one. And I'll see you around. Peace.